a local organization that helps small businesses, is relaunching a lending program designed to help artists. It was one of Altcap's fastest growing short term loans before COVID struck. Fox Force Kevin Berry joins us with how it could have a broader impact again, Kevin. Yeah, John, Lauren, artists say the traditional places for small businesses to get loans like banks often don't want to lend to them. Well, Chris Dahlquist says it has a lot to do with the perception that creative people don't always know how to be business people. Just like a doctor doesn't learn how to run the office uh, in their training, neither does an artist. So that's why Chris worked with local organizations like AltCap and ArtsKC to create ArtCap, giving small loans to creators of all kinds to do specific projects or grow their business. Artists oftentimes are working at such narrow margins that they never establish enough capital to build the next project. Altcap's Megan Crook says their mission, getting loans to people and businesses that larger lenders often pass on, lines up perfectly with the issue that artists have faced. I think it's hard sometimes for mainstream finance to understand the business of arts. Before the pandemic, Megan says it was Altcap's fastest growing program. They took a two year break to get small businesses through COVID, but now they're turning back to what worked before to pull Kansas City into the future. Dana Knapp advocates for artists leading ArtKC. A creative and artistic community attracts workforce, attracts business. And on the numbers side, Megan says artists have actually proven themselves to be great bets for lenders. Artists are incredible borrowers. They know their business as well. And all caps definition of an artist is actually pretty broad. It includes visual artists, painters, photographers, but also actors, musicians and other kinds of creators and makers. We have information about that program right now at Fox4KC.com.